Hi viewers, how are you? Welcome to my YouTube channel Samiullah Khan 92. Today my topic is about how to change the contactor of the chiller. It's a cutler hammer contactor of 120 ampere and a three phase contactor and 110 volt coil. First of all, you have to close the main power of the chiller. Uh, you must sure that your main power of chiller is uh, close then you can remove the cable of contactor from uh, uh, cable connector of the contactor you can see these three cables uh, three phase uh, all three phase you must remove from the top and from the bottom then you have to uh, open the cable of uh, 110 volt coil you can see there inside this is 110 volt uh, coil contactor because control of the chiller is 110 volt then you can remove this uh, screw, uh, bolt screw from the contactor to remove the old contactor. Then uh, when we can remove this uh, old contactor, then uh, we have to fix the new one because this contactor is damaged. It's not a big deal to remove, uh, just uh, three screw bolts uh, are fixed there. You can easily remove these three uh, screw bolts and remove your contactor it's uh, very easy to remove you can see this uh, now our contactor is out uh, so we need a new one now to fix this so we need a new one let's see this is our new one cutler hammer 120 ampere contactor you can see this is our new contactor uh, so we can fix this one now so we are starting to fix this so we can uh, put this on the same position where is the old one and then we need to tightly screw the bolts uh, these three bolts again to fix uh, this on the position you can see this is one uh, and two this is another one we have total uh, three uh, bolts for this contactor after fixing you can check this is uh, uh, okay uh, then after uh, fixing uh, the base of the contactor you have to fix the connector connector uh, nuts you can see this is first one we can we are fixing this connector so we must fix uh, these connectors uh, not came in the new one we take from the old one and fix on this one so you have six uh, connectors uh, of the conductor uh, these connectors uh, are used for the uh, cables of the compressor and uh, main power so these six connectors uh, first we can fix these all six connectors so <coughs> after fixing i'll show you how to use uh, how to fix the cables after fixing this all we need to fix uh, the cables uh, so for all uh, six connectors are almost uh, fixed now you must uh, confirm that the strength of the bolt nut is uh, good you can check all one by one all six connectors after this uh, you can uh, fix the three phase cables you must uh, uh, know all the cables on the same position so this is our 110 volt uh, coil uh, uh, so we can fix the coil uh, came from these two cables came from the control of the chiller this is 110 volt coil uh, because the chiller uh, chiller control is 110 volt so we fix this uh, 110 volt uh, line then we can fix the all uh, six cables of the three phase uh, uh, you need star allen key to tie this uh, must uh, check all after fixing these uh, three cables this came from the supply you can see this uh, one uh, one b two b three b these three line cables uh, you must uh, know the position of the cables uh, the same position you have to fix the same position otherwise maybe you damage your compressor uh, because we need the same phase in the same line uh, 
uh, so main ke uh, main supply cables are fixed now now we are going to fix uh, the compressor cables these cables came from the compressor side uh, this also need the star allen key to fix uh, this all you see we are fixing the first one uh, also show also make sure the cable all the three cables uh, must be uh, on the same position from where you remove you must remember the cables uh, we know which cable we remove from which place uh, but uh, you if you write on some paper or any uh, place or mark with the taping uh, it's uh, good so we fix this one so our last one is uh, remaining we have to fix the last one uh, let's see this is the last one so all the three phase uh, are complete now from the compressor side also uh, from uh, chiller side we uh, fix uh, first so it's uh, not a big deal uh, it's uh, very easy to uh, fix the contactor So our last one is also fixed. So you can see this. This is all complete now. You make sure your connections are good, good connection. Because if you make a loose connection, it will make a spark, and spark is uh, very uh, dangerous. You know, maybe burn your cable. Uh, if the phase uh, you lost one phase from the compressor, it will damage your compressor. But in this chiller, we have, we have safety of also phase. If phase loss, it will not start. Uh, now we can fix the top cover of the contactor. We have all four screw there, so we can make uh, the screw tight and uh, complete our job. You can see so we you need. Uh, star uh, screwdriver or you can use the tester no problem which is available or which suitable for you you can use so this is our uh, contactor so you can see we completely change our contactor of chiller uh, this is cutler hammer 120 ampere uh, contactor these are the contactors used for outdoor fans uh, condenser fans fuses and all the control of the chiller so this is all about uh, our uh, contactor change video i'll share more videos with you in in future kindly like and subscribe my channel samiullah khan 92 thanks for much watching my videos goodbye